paragraph has developed techniques to produce graphene on various types of materials and substrates, and also to surround graphene with additional materials in order to create device structures on a wafer scale. By choosing appropriate materials and processes, Paragraph is able to create electronic devices that benefit from the unique properties of graphene. We're the first to use graphene in the mass production of electronic components, but making use of standard semiconductor processes. So I'm not sure, maybe many are not familiar with graphene. This is kind of a miracle material uh, that was discovered actually 2004 uh, in Manchester, UK. And then a Nobel Prize was awarded to its discoverers in 2010. Graphene has a number of very interesting attributes. Um, its connectivity is 1,000 times out of copper. So it has the potential to really transform the design of transistors to reboot Moore's Law. It's optically transparent, making it possible for better optoelectronics. Um, it's mechanically very interesting, it's very durable. One of its really interesting attributes is it's biocompatible. So it really opens new horizons for clinical diagnostics and the other kinds of biosensors that could really transform the industry in healthcare. The fact that we've now made graphene an industry ready solution from a semiconductor perspective, this is opening up possibilities and solutions for some really critical challenges that are facing the world at our time that the kind of energy consumption that the world is seeing, um, there's an exponential growth in energy consumption for data centers, uh, largely built around the pretty bad performance per power for high performance compute. Graphene has the potential to give us a, a two orders of magnitude improvement in terms of compute performance, but at half the power. Uh, when you look at uh, data transfer, um, Data transfer is a bottleneck for learning and for information transfer and uh, graphene has the potential to unlock terahertz broadband to bring more data to more people. And then we come back to healthcare and what's possible with clinical diagnostics, the fact that graphene, graphene could kind of democratize biosensing to bring faster diagnostics to more people saving more lives. Um, so we see great opportunities commercially, but even more importantly, we see the opportunity to solve some really critical global problems. And, and, and we're really thrilled and honored to be part of doing that. Just want to say that it's been, first of all, just a great honor for us to have been chosen um, as third place um, and the only non-Taiwan winner. Um, that's a great honor and we're, and we're very thankful for that. Um, we've appreciated the opportunity to come and network and meet all of the people that we've met. Um, and uh, it's just been a really great experience for us corporately.